Hello everybody. Hello everybody. We are gay because we didn't do story time in a super long time. Because I've been watching, I've been watching some, I sometimes watch Lolly on one videos. And we didn't do ours music and story time in a super long time. Yeah, not since last Friday. It's been a whole week since we've done story time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What have we been up to? We are up to, to our plan. And we are on such a rush for plan when we wake up. We've been in a rush for plans when we wake up. Willow has been in a rush for plans when we wake up. Yeah, definitely. But today's plans are to do story time with our buddies. And I see that we've got Chloe and Phoenix and <gasps> Daphne watching. Hi, and, guys. And also I see Celia and Kira. Celia and Kira and Gizmo and Gadget. Whoa. And hi, Timothy. Oh, I think we have... Um... Um... Lots of friends. Lots of friends. Lots of fun. All right, friends. So the first thing we need to do is... Say okay, hello. Say hello. We're going to say hello. And then we've got some great songs and some stories for today. Mm -hmm. Right? But this is an animal story. An animal story. Maybe so. But we're going to start by saying hello. Are you ready? Yeah. Oh. Hey, 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 what do you say? I'm so glad you're here today. Hey, hey, come on and play with Wit and Willow. Hey, hey, what do you say? I'm so glad you're here today. Hey, hey, come on and play with Wit and Willow. Grab your bag and come on out. There's so much to do. Give away and give a shout. Oh, I'm so glad you're here today. Good morning. And today, 
I'm going to read you a song. And it's about a really tiny time capsule. And it's about a seed. And then a pop. Seed is in our caterpillar. It is about a caterpillar. So let's see our caterpillar book. Hey, Quinn and Gus. But, it's been but, a long but, time. But after Mommy's investment book, I'm going to read you. I'm going to sing you a book. Very good idea. I like that idea. But first, we're going to read The Hungry Caterpillar. Do you want to show them your Hungry Caterpillar friends that you brought? Oh, yeah. I got Mr. Caterpillar. Mr. Caterpillar. And who else? And Baby Caterpillar. Baby Caterpillar. And Daddy Caterpillar. And Daddy Caterpillar. There's Mr. Caterpillar, Daddy Caterpillar, and Baby Caterpillar. I like it. And what a great family. And so we've got a book about a caterpillar because Willow last week got some caterpillar friends and we're watching them grow into butterflies. And after the book, we're also going to show you our caterpillar friends. But, but something happened last night and we can't quite show you them as caterpillars, can we? What happened last night while we were sleeping? The chrysalis. They turned into chrysalises. We were going to show you our caterpillars. Now we'll just have to show you our chrysalises. But first we're going to read The Hungry. Hungry. Caterpillar. Caterpillar. So, okay. so I'm, going to, I'm going to hold it. Okay, you hold it and you open it up for me. The Hungry Caterpillar. The sun comes up, Pop. And, and the hungry caterpillar light in his leaf. That's right. In the light of the moon, on a little egg, he lay on his leaf. And let's bring it nice and close so they can all see. I can get There it. he is. Good job. I can hold it, Mama. How about I turn the page and you read the next page? There we can go. Can I hold it, please, Mommy? Yep. Can I read it first? On Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop! Out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. Oh, I think that's the page you were actually talking about. There he is, the tiny little caterpillar right there. And the big, beautiful sun. I can... All right, you turn the page. <gasps> and and then the, the caterpillar egg. One apple. Yes, on what day? On? Monday. Monday. He ate through one apple, but... He was still hungry. Hungry. And he ate two pears. Yep, turn this way so they can see. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. Hungry. Oh, man. What a hungry guy. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums. Yep, one, two, three plums. plums. But he was still hungry. hungry. And one, it, two, all they can see is your head. Four. <laughs> On Thursday, he ate through four. one, two, three, four. Four. Four what? Four strawberries. Four strawberries. But he was still hungry. He was still hungry. This is a hungry caterpillar. I don't think I could eat this much food. Mm -mm. On Friday, he ate through one. Mm -hmm. Two, two, three, four, five. What are those? Oranges. Five oranges. Yeah, come sit next to me and read it. Five but, oranges, but, but he was still hungry. hungry. There you go. Let's turn the page. Ready? But I want to hold. I know you can. Turn the page. Go ahead. <gasps> On Saturday, he ate through... One Two. slice of cake. One ice cream. One salami. What? That's not salami. What is that? A pickle. A pickle. One slice of cheese. One salami. One lava. One cheese. That's not cheese. What is that? Cake. Pie. Ice. Yum. One salami. sausage. One, one cupcake. cupcake and one slice of watermelon. Watermelon. Mm, 
yummy. But that night he had a tummy, tummy ache. Ouch. Oh man. The next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf, leaf. crunch. And then he felt much better. That happens to me sometimes too. Sometimes I just need a salad. Salad. Well, now he wasn't hungry anymore. And he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big, Bat. fat caterpillar. Look at that caterpillar. He's so big. That's just what happened to ours, right? Mm -hmm. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon and he pushed his way out. And there's his cocoon. Sometimes you call them cocoons and sometimes you call them chrysalis. Right? He nibbled his way out and what do you think is going to happen? He turned into a beautiful butterfly. He turned into a beautiful butterfly. And That's he, right. And you know Snip, what? snap, snout, and, this tail and is... And you know what mm, this one does? Oh. Yeah, you ready? Leah gave us this one. Are you ready to see what our caterpillar does? Let's see. Here, let me help with the zipper. Did it get stuck? Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. There we go. Let's see if we can turn it. So, ready? Count with me. One, two, three. Alakazam, it turned into a beautiful butterfly. There she goes. And you know what? It's stuck. Yep, and then this zips back up on the other side. So, I think I have a song about some caterpillars and butterflies, no, and I, I know Willow's got a song too, right? Do you? Mm -hmm. Are you gonna make up a song today? Well, it's about a really, really big caterpillar. Oh boy, a hungry one? A real, um, not really hungry one. Not hungry, just big, okay. Big. I am ready, I think. Okay. Uh, okay. This is Willow's improv improvised original. Don't like time. Yep. Yeah.
my song. Woo. Willow loves to make up songs. That's something you can do when you're stuck at home. You don't need a guitar, right? You can just make up a song. You can make one up for your mom. Whoa. You can make one up for your dad. I okay. can. Can, you... can I sing my caterpillar song too? Well, it's I... actually about an inchworm. And I think some of my friends might know it. And maybe, maybe you could help me sing it and you can learn it too. Well, I'm going to sing Are you coming in? Pop! <laughs> just like a caterpillar, you just popped in. All right, if you know this one, sing along. And if you don't, I bet you'll learn pretty quickly. It goes inchworm, inchworm. Measuring the marigolds Seems to me you'd stop and see How beautiful they are Inchworm, inchworm Measuring the marigolds Seems to me you'd stop and see How beautiful they are good at making up songs. You know, we have one more song about a butterfly that you and I made up a long time ago when you were pretty little. It's about a butterfly flying away all the way home, up into the air, over the trees. Butterfly, butterfly, fly away from me. And then you can put all sorts of other things that fly. So can you start thinking about some things that fly? And can you start thinking about some things that fly? And if you think of something, you can type it in and I'll see if I can put it into my song, all right? Well, we're gonna start with butterfly while you're thinking of those things that fly. So this song goes like this. And you can make yourself fly too, right? You can spread your arms out and fly like a butterfly. It goes, butterfly, butterfly, fly away home. Far from your mother, far will you roam. Up in the air and over the trees. that one more time. Ooh, 
somebody else said something and it's not an animal, it's a thing. Can you think of a thing that flies in the sky? Um, a bird. It's something you ride inside. Astronauts. And, oh, astronauts do, I like that one. We're gonna do their, their one first, they said airplane, and then we can do astronauts next because I love that. Airplane, airplane, fly away home. Far from your mother, far will you roam. Up in the air and over the trees. Airplane, airplane, fly away from me. And astronauts was Willow's idea. Here it goes. Astronaut, astronaut, fly away home. Far from your mother, far will you roam. Up in the air and over the trees. Someone had a great idea, a bumblebee. Bzzz, bzzz, oh, bzzz. should we sing it with a buzzy voice? Bzzz, bzzz. Bumblebee, bumblebee, fly away home. Fly from your mother, far will you roam? Bzzz, up in the air and over the trees. Bumblebee, bumble, fly away from me. Butterfly. Oh. Somebody said unicorns. Yes. Some unicorns fly, don't they? Butterflies. They have horns and wings. Butterflies. We'll do some unicorns and then we'll go back to butterflies. Ready? Unicorn, unicorn, fly away home. Far from your mother, far will you roam. Up in the air and over the trees. Unicorn, unicorn, fly away from me. Butterflies. Butterfly, butterfly, fly away home. Far from your mother, far will you roam. Up in the and over the butterfly, butterfly away from me. And I have a butterfly. Because it's raining outside today. Well, you know what? We only have a few minutes left clap, clap, before clap, we have clap. to do our, our other group. We sing with some seniors after this at 11. So before we want to run out of time, I know you want to show everybody your caterpillars. Now, nobody here has been outside of our living room, but we're going to bring you into our kitchen because we want to show you our caterpillars and what they turned into last night. So here we go. I hope it's not too messy. We're going into the kitchen. We're gonna turn on the lights. Let's see. Whoop. And we're gonna see if we can hold this up really close because they are not, where are they? There they are. They are not caterpillars anymore. They are now chrysalises. Hanging there, do you see them? Yeah, and I'm in There's one, two, three, four, five chrysalises. One is actually still kind of turning into it, and the other ones are all in their little cozy sleeping bags. And also I got cookies. And also Willow wants to show you her cookies. All right, back to the living room. Quick, quick, quick. Let's sing one more song. I hope you enjoyed meeting our caterpillar friends in their cozy, cozy sleeping bags. We're not going to open cookies right now, though, right? Don't bring me the mud. <laughs> Maybe we'll make cookies later today. I think we have just enough time. Let me check. Yeah, we have enough time to sing a nice, good oh, and farewell song. Yeah. yeah, but first, I got a rain song because it's raining outside. A quick rain song into a goodbye song? It sounds like a plan. Yeah. Okay. Is it the rain, rain, go away? Yes. Okay. Rain, rain, go away. Come on, help me out. Oh, rain, rain, go away. Come again some other day. Everybody wants to 
sometimes I don't even need the rain to go away. I can just go out and play in it or dance in it or sing in it. Cause I'm singing in the rain. I'm singing in the rain. What a glorious feeling. I'm happy again. I'm smiling again. So high up above the sun in my heart. And I'm ready for love. Let the stormy clouds chase everyone from this place. Come on with the rain, I've a smile on my face. I walk down the lane with a happy refrain. Cause I'm singing, I'm singing in the rain. They still have books online at the Lahaska Bookshop. We wouldn't have a story time with Win and Willow if the Lahaska Bookshop hadn't gotten us started. So be sure to support your local bookshops. If you feel like leaving a tip, we also have a link for Venmo or PayPal. But we're also just happy you're here. All right, see you next week. See you next week. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.